What's going on, everyone? Kami here. And, you know, the, the Vivian's considered kind of boring. At least I kind of consider her boring. I mean, she's pretty basic. Her Q allows her to left click more. Her right click makes her left click better. Her ults just makes her left click better. You know what I mean? It's just like, well, whatever. But I was going through suggested loadouts, and I know I specifically got one from a person named James Hates Bread. And he was just like, man, I really want you to do a Vivian build. You can get like movement speed and stuff like that. And he showed me the build, and uh, it was kind of a basic Vivian build, but he wanted to see some Vivian. I was looking through, I saw another one from Angie Kilua, and uh, then I found one from Indulgence. And Indulgence had one that uh, did not run controlling nature to three, ran it at a one, and it bumped up. I think he had like uh, nowhere to hide up a little bit higher. But uh, this one's going to be going with Booby Trap, which makes it so when you detonate, you, you kill people. Well, at least you do damage. And uh, this is a different way to play Vivian. The other ones were just kind of like, you know, good Vivian loadouts, but I kind of wanted to switch it up and try out the, um, try out the Booby Trap, because I never really do it. We're going to give it a try. Now, the other one I may actually try... But the other one was more about just keeping your um, keeping your sensory drone up, and that would allow you to. Whoa. Okay, there we go. I was like, booby trap needs to go off. The other one was just keeping it up. You weren't running booby trap, but you were running. You were just doing it for the uh, vision, right? And this one does give vision, but it also knocks people off their mounts, and it's super rudy poo. Where I want to go. This one also still has a lot of movement speed, which I think is almost just damn near necessary. We're going to have our... Uh... Hey, what's up? I'm trying to shoot your tootsies. Here, have that. Boop. Oh, no, or not. And I'm just realizing this is much more of an iron sight skin. I don't know if I like that. I think I want to change this. The other one had like a weird iron sight. Did I throw that like on them? We're gonna have our queue up in a second. Well, not quick enough. But you know, I just figured, hey, let's give it a try. Let's give it a try. It's just weird though with booby trap, and you get an additional, uh, you get additional reveal distance that doesn't affect the actual booby trap detonation range. It's still only 20 units, and I was testing it out in the training ground, and the training ground showed it to be about 40 units or so. The default, um, well, that just bounces off. The default, the default reveal radius. Oh, I'm gonna back off here. Oh, okay. Okay, they're still revealed. Another thing to note is, um... There is a card in here that's also pretty good, but I don't know if I like it. And that is, you get life still for people revealed by your... By your sentry drone. And it's like... Oh, I can almost shoot through that. There's a card that gives you life steal just flat out. And I think that that card is pretty good. And I, it's just, it's a, it's a little less, it's a little less than the ones with the drone, but it's all the time. So that's really nice. <laughs> booby trap kill. <laughs> the boobies of the trappies. Uh oh, that's not good. Let's back off here a little bit. With our iron sight Vivian skin. What, what happened to me? Huh? Let's get that trap drop right there. Ooh. Boop. Whoa, whoa. Oh, I hit her. I hit her like illusion. Or I hit her, uh, her ult. That's so good, dude. Oh, my game is breaking. Oh, my game is breaking. Oh, it's breaking real bad, guys. I'm back. Don't worry about it. Oh, you can't hurt me. <laughs> Here's another booby trap. The spot is so good for booby traps. You just keep popping it up and then you keep blasting them back. That's funny. Put that right to the next of us so we can actually hit the ash. <laughs> she couldn't get through the doorway. Oh, this is pretty. This is pretty good. That's pretty good. Mm, where can I put this? I can put that like right there, maybe? You can try to stun? Yeah, you did try to stun. Oh, right, you're going up. Going up there. I should probably reload. We don't have infinite ammo. We have a lot of ammo, but we don't have... Oh! I set up that trap. That way when they run through it, they... Uh, hopefully we'll take some damage. Uh oh, where's that Androx at? I hear him dash. Now, will that... Bo I don't think that'll boop her up enough to where it'll matter. We have yet to really need to use our Q. I mean, we could use it right now. I guess I should have got a little bit closer. Try to pump up our ult a little bit more. I, I'm pretty sure I don't have my ult up anymore. No, no, no. They just, they just got blown up. It's crazy. I, I, I could have swore back when I played Vivian in the first place. It just kind of felt like you had your your 
drones up all the time. By drones, I mean, what are they called? Sentinels. You had your sentinels. You had your ults up all the time, but now uh, they just kind of die from stuff and they don't really have that much blast damage. They have the pip, but they just kind of die. I think you definitely want to try to keep your distance a little bit more when you have your ult and just blast because if you with their ult up, it's just nuts. As for item choices, we could go with nimble. Do we want to go nimble? Yeah, I think we do. Yeah, I think we do. We want to go with some nimble. Nimble poo. We don't want bulldozer, obviously. Wrecker, I mean, they have fortress breaker, but eh. Ooh, let's see if we can boop her. Never mind. Let's see if we can boop her off. That's a. Ooh, we're gonna drop a little bit so that way the shield is covering the top portion of our, of our body. And that's all they could see. I need to try to help out. Hey, there we go. I'm gonna throw that right on the tree. Oh, no, we're not. We're not gonna throw that at anybody, actually. Play it cool. Ooh, have you met my friends? Booby trap. We'll place that over there to make sure. Whoa, why are you revealed? That's interesting. Someone coming up there. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, ho. so much damage, dude. They just happened to run in at the right time. And they just ate it, man. Ate it. Ash? Got our Q up so we can just blast this. Drop one right there. Oh, no. This might be bad, but no, Vivian's just nuts, dude. Vivian's just boop, nuts with the ult up. Insane a membrane. Oh, hey, we got a heal. Nice. Boop. We have both of them up. So you can tell. You can tell when you have them up. It's something I, I, I kept checking my, um, kept checking, like, pressing B to look to see if I could see my little, my little, uh, sentinels up. We now know they're called sentinels. Helpful. Totally. I feel like I'm not using this as the uh, intended use. <laughs> like, uh, I'm not using too much. I don't want her blasting my sentinels off. For the for the reveal, we're kind of just saving it for or we want to burst. Oh, blow up. There it goes. Oh, we can't hit him. Then Droxus went somewhere. And Droxus is still alive. Yes, I don't know where he went, though. He's still, like, floating up in the air. Maybe just, like, stuck there. Oh, I got sucked up by the shield. Uh, the back roll. That boy still. Ah, oh, this is not good, team. We're gonna try to blast this there. No. Whoa. Oh no. Don't do me, Pip. Don't do me like this. <laughs> uh, we have both of our sentinels down right now, so that's it's yeah, whatever. Pop that right there. Oh, she didn't push anymore. We can get this kill. We believe. We believe. <laughs> Terrifying. Like just haunting my nightmares, dude. Ooh, there is an Androxus behind us. And we know that because we have wall hacks. Oh, he's gonna fight me? Oh, that one seems a little bit ballsy. That seems very ballsy with that type of HP. Do we want to go ultimate? Oh, game. Game. Oh, where am I? Found me. I gotta stop bringing up these these little freezes. You all see them. I don't need to bring them up. Uh, to anyone that's been down in the comments suggesting things I could do, I've tried pretty much everything. Even something as, so, as unorthodox as someone suggested that my graphics card is a little bit too good for this game. And uh, to turn on DSR, which is uh, dynamic scale resolution or, or, or uh, digital scale resolution, it essentially allows you to mimic 1440p. So he suggested it to turn it up by like 1.25 or something to make it so... Uh, I'd stress my, what else do I want here? Morale boost, let's go morale boost. To stress my my graphics card more because what's happening is he's thinking that it just wasn't being used at all. So cranking it up makes it so it won't fall asleep. I don't even know if that's a thing, you know, but that's a feels bad man for him. I have heard of them. Double kill, triple kill. Going for a quadra kill. Well, that's not gonna happen. Whatever. And we are aiming down the site a lot because I'm just gonna get that mild on, but it back off. Wee! Absolutely melted. We're aiming down our sights a lot because remember we have that card that I bumped up a little bit compared to their old one. The uh, indulgence that most people that had this only had this at a level one. But I was like, you know, it's more fun to try to get these up as much as possible. Where'd that Androxus go? I'm not very good at placing these at <laughs> these uh, mines, by the way. Where is it? Oh, there's an ash. We gotta try to run through that. Wee! Boo! Oh wait, that, that didn't blow up? That's weird. You win. You win. What I was trying to say earlier about the whole, uh, you know, DSR turning on and stuff like that, it didn't help. Sadly, it did not help. I think there's something else with my hard drive, honestly. If I had to put my finger on it, it... Do I want to go Kronos? 
What is the base cooldown of our sensor drone? 10 seconds? So each level will take, each chronos will take off one point or one, uh, one second. That's pretty good. Did I place that on the shield? That's probably not great. Hey, but we're getting, we're getting the reveal and it means we're getting the life steal. Ah, that was also bad. Damn me. Damn me. Bop, 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 bop. Is there someone else over here to the left? There is. There's also an ash over there. Oh, never mind. Try to snap that over there. Oh, Vivian. What are you doing? I have met your friends. They're also my friends. Are they my friends though? Like are all Vivian's same friends with the, the same people? Or is that, is that Vivianist? How does that work? Trying to snipe through there. I get a little bit more shots. He's going to be coming down there. Anara's going to be able to shut him off. Oh, Pip, you little sneaky, sneaky man. Where'd he go? Oh, Pip is... Where'd Pip go? Is Pip here? Oh, he's flying, dude. He made me think about Alton. There's no time for that. Nailed it. Totally. It's also really nice that the... While the mine is down, the cooldown starts. Because I think you can actually have two mines down at once. This sounds really dumb. And I should know that. But it's actually not in the sensory drone description. So I found that very weird. Well, I kind of just want to get that down so I can get life leech on him. Okay. I probably worked a little bit too hard on getting that. Since the Androx is down, we're going to go ahead and ult. We shouldn't have to worry too much about dealing with anybody right now. Oh, man. She's just... I swear, she pulled out her friends while after I pulled out my friends. Is that... Is that how it works? Boop! I should have my... Yeah, okay. That's up right now. We have vision on people. Oh, pop a shield. Back out. Quit shooting my friends. That's friend on friend crime, my friends. Right. Might be able to... If I just pull this down a little bit. There we go. That's another thing, too. I've noticed with the other loadouts that I was talking about at the very beginning of the video where they were... They seemed a little bit more basic. Is they, the, A lot of them stressed on... A lot of them stressed on recoil reduction and aim down sight faster. I thought that was interesting. <laughs> Boop. Okay, so in in hopes of getting an environmental kill, we are going to max out our master writing or of the memes, some would say. And uh, we're just going to run over to the left side and get underneath. And hopefully that'll allow us to do it. There's not too much space to run here, so I don't know if we'll be able to ooh. see if it works. Someone run down the ramp. No, you guys are ruining my environmental kill. The worst. Oh, we're in Droxus. We got to go. Never mind. We're good. Oh, my chicken. Jump up. Jump up. Jump up and get down. Rest in peace, buddy. Rest in, rest in pants. Mm. Now, another thing, too, is this, this mine tends to... Oh, she's moving real fast, my friend. I'm going to try to boop her away. Right there. No. Oh, does the mine kill? Nope, it didn't. Ah, ah, shield, shield. Not enough. This is hectic. We just lost ourselves, but it looks like the rest of our team is able to stay alive for a little bit longer. Ooh, but they look like they're kind of overwhelming us. It's it's overwhelming how overwhelming they are, actually. We might have time for another retake. Mm, heard Androx is dashing. Where'd uh, nobody? Run into my mine. You know you want to. You know it to be true. Almost got our ult up. Oh, there's the ult. Have you met my friends? Here, have that. I see you. Uh oh. Nice wall by the Inara. And I think that's going to secure it. Nice job, Inara. Big place, big place. I'm actually curious what the Shaba. Oh, Shaba was also going booby trap. I didn't notice that. Maxed out movement speed, reduce the recoil. Deflector shield is active. I, I do like scapegoat in a lot of my builds. Extra uh, shield health and the reveal persists two seconds after the reveal range. I, I think I started to say something earlier in the video, but I, I didn't get around to it. Uh, and I'll just mention, mention that crack the whip, 40% life steal against enemies revealed by sensory drone and getting the extra, I'm blind as all hell, sensory drone reveal persists two seconds after an enemy leaves its reveal range. A bug to where if they are within that extra reveal range, like they're they're out of it, but they're they're on that two second persistence, the life steal doesn't work. And I don't know if that's intended or if that is meant to happen that way. It kind of works the same way as Tyro where you get like bonus damage, but if you increase the reveal range, 
the reveal duration, then you still don't get the bonus damage on the Hunter's Mark because of the way that it's worded. But to be fair, uh, the wording is gain 40% life steal against enemies revealed by your sensory drones. So if it's being revealed due to the card that gives it two seconds after an enemy leaves the reveal range, it should work. I don't know. I, it's hard to say if it's really a bug. The game was relatively quick, but I do want to try to get one more game in and I just eh, screw it, man. I'm going to play the build that uh, James sent me. He was the one that messaged me at the very beginning. He was like, I want you to play Vivian. Vivian to me, again, just kind of hold left click. You do a lot of damage, but uh, I I'm really interested to see. He has a lot of like anti recoil and more aim down sight speed. And I think I'm going to run, I could run opportunity and chaos, but I might run the other one that makes it so my shield can come back up and it allows me to be up in the fray a little bit more. I'll show you the loadout and the, and, and the whole build and whatnot when we get into the next game. But before we jump in, we have two gifts open. Spicy Water coming in with two of them, a small and a medium gift. GG, let's play again. We all know what's going to happen. Mm, we were at 863, I think, last time. So there's our small gift. Thank you, Spicy Water. And then Spicy Water coming in with another one. So that's, what did I say? 80, 863, 867. We're like at like 870 something. I'll give it another check, but we're about 100 away. I can feel it. I can feel it. Okay, game two. It's kind of debatable if we want to go Opportunity and Chaos or Suspect Everyone, but I like Suspect Everyone giving you a little bit. She has so much damage in her base kit, especially when we're going up against a buck that can leap on us. I think Suspect Everyone is going to be pretty good because it essentially uh, can give us a chance to be able to get two shields off against a buck if we use our shield right away. Just hope they don't shoot my tootsies. Uh, this build again is from James Hates Bread on Discord or Zero Tags that has level five lightweight alloy. One, st uh, one step ahead, eyes on the prize, nowhere to hide in contingency. There are a few things I'd probably tweak with this build, but let's give it a try because I just want to see, like, there's, I'm so tempted a lot of times when I, stupid bush cactus thingy, when I see a build, I'm just like, I want to tweak this and here and there, but it's like, that's not really what we're going for, man, you know? Whoa. Whoa. Well, the thing is, oh my god, there's no recoil. I'm trying to help you, buddy. Oh no. If I could turn back time. That looks like it's buggy with how fast... Holy crap, dude. Here's a lifesteal. That looks buggy, though, how fast that, that comes in. It's kind of nuts. Where's the cooldown on my... Oh, that's a... I just got eaten. I just got eaten alive right there. Whoops. All right, going back into it. Strix, don't shoot me, please. I'm going to try to push on that Strix over on... The, oh, he's right here. I'll just instantly aim down my sight for no reason. It feels like if we have no reason to aim down sight... Let's really test this out. Let's just shoot at this. Shoot at this. Oh, hello. Hello at people kind of long range and you can see the aiming down the site mid range is really not that important now that range man, might be important to aim down there but in general here we can try to snipe this <laughs> this strix that feels weird to say but we're gonna try to snipe this strix see how much damage we can do just spraying Eh, this kind of sucks this isn't exactly oh i can just do that and then i can i can reveal him here i want to test this out Oh, and the other thing is, we need to... Whoa! We need... Damn it. We need to remember of the glitch. I think it's a glitch. Where uh, the the talent that we have, suspect everyone, where our, our shield gets reduced in half if we get it destroyed by a person. We always want to hit the Q button early. <laughs> uh, we need to back off. Because that'll... That'll, um, that'll trigger it. Let's go ahead and give it a try. Oh, no, maybe not. Interesting. All right, we're gonna give it a try. Here we go. And we're just gonna shoot long range with just our left click. We're not going to... Oh, might be a little bit dangerous here to... Oh, man. Oh, is no one gonna be able to get out there? Oh, the McCoy with the last minute save, dude. There's so much people down there. I think that might be... Oh, no. Okay, we're aiming down sight. I think aiming down sight at this range might be... Who's, who's winding up? Who's that, huh? Oh, put our shield up. But I was just trying to say from the very beginning that, like, pop my Q again. Oh, I think they fixed it. Okay. Good to know. The the enemies actually have to destroy it. Hmm. I don't know if this, this talent is that good. Yeah, see, look at that. Oh, wait, this person. He can't make it over there. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. That's a really cool effect with this skin to, um... 
<laughs> but her shield has a really cool effect when it when it goes down. Like, look at all this stuff on the screen. You don't even really notice it, but like this red thing and it kind of goes away and you get these red little sentinels up at the top. Again, we learned they were called sentinels. I'm kind of a big deal. I will say at the very least, I am genuinely surprised how much lightweight alloy does help. But with, with no card that gives you any benefit of aiming down sight, you honestly don't need to aim down sight that much. And the extra recoil reduction, while kind of nice, uh, maybe it can allow you to... Maybe it can allow you to get more. Eh, I was just thinking about picking up Nimble, but I'm just thinking about going for Max. Max, uh, Cauterize. Now, when I say there's no reason to aim down Precision Sights, like, she does have, he does have reduced recoil. Whoa. He does have reduced recoil when he aims down sight, which is nice. But again, like, just shooting like this, can't do that. Ooh. That doesn't help out too much. Hey, there, Black Betty. Here we go, let's test this out. Well, the Lex ruined that. But you, geez, you hit a decent amount of shots, not even aimed on sight. I, I feel like aiming down sight is just kind of a... It's a whatever. You know? It's like, yeah, you could do it, you could not do it. You seem to have got yourself a person there. <laughs> this just feels like a... She actually almost makes me kind of feel like I'm playing Call of Duty, which is kind of weird to say, but it really does. Let me out. Let me out. Okay. Who's going on? Who's who's partying over here? Nara, was, was I not invited? Did I not get the R I RSVP'd with a friend? It was me and Makoa. Makoa came. I think they're trying to tell me. I think they're trying to say they're not. I'm, me and my friends are not welcome, which is rude. Boop. Can we see? Okay, look where this shoots. So it's shooting like right around where the crosshair is, where obviously if we aim down sights, it's going to be 100% accurate. So yes, I mean, like, it's kind of what you expect. Aim down sights makes it a little bit, uh, makes it more accurate if you're not aiming down sights. But the thing is, I keep stressing this, the amount of accuracy you have without aiming down sights, you just be like, good enough? Is this buck going to jump on us? Or... Good enough. Found the buck. I'm sorry, Makoa. Wait, I'm not sorry. Yo, I'm sorry, Makoa. I feel kind of like a dick saying that. <laughs> I'm not sorry as he dies. Ooh, ooh. Okay, we will aim down sight at this range, obviously. Ooh, I'm gonna stand next to this this Gordy Poo. Right, this was maybe a bad move by the Anara. You guys think about that? <laughs> Still have both of our both of our sentinels up, dude. Now I'm like I'm like second guessing myself about how accurate. Ooh. How accurate it is aiming down sights and not aiming down sights. On their way. Oh, I seem to have found someone here. Ooh, let's go ahead and push the payload up. Oh, don't we? Huh? Oh, it's party now. I'm gonna force that rewind down. If he doesn't have the rewind, he's just gonna die. Cool. If I could. Oh, I have my ult up and I haven't even, like, expended my ult yet. Ooh, wee! Morale boost, too. It's crazy about how much my my um, my illusions were getting, or my, my sentinels were getting busted down in the last game, but not so much in this game. I wonder if it was just a lot of the splash damage. Ooh, that's a... Let's go ahead and just let this shield maybe disappear. Shoot me. Huh. Well, that sucks. It's like my things are too powerful. My shield's too powerful. I don't want to get extra... Oh, no. Now, this was a good move by the... Oh. That was a good move by the NR. That was a good time to push. <laughs> All right, now we've gotten ourselves uh, Nimble Nimble 3 and Cauterize 3, so that's going to feel really good. We have no lifesteal built into this deck, or this uh, build, so I'm going to go ahead and ult right now. Try to give us that extra damage, and we will. Oh, is that a buck over there? Can't tell. Oh, the Makoa couldn't get over there. Let's just not peek out anymore, because we don't want our Sentinels to really take any damage. Hey, free kill. Or not. Uh, Alice is over down here. There's someone else, I think. Strix is over there. Let's just go jump on that Strix. Give me a minute. Oh, me and Indulgence got the same same idea here. You guys just need to stay alive for a second. That'll do. This Anara has no... Oh, wait, no. She does have a healer. You know, fly somewhere. I think we can... There we go. We got our shield. Hopefully he misses my tootsies. Oh, I'm here to help. Ooh. We have a chance here. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, we just gotta chill here for a second, and then maybe try to... Ah, I gotta touch the point just to be safe. Hold on a minute. 
Big fear. I gotta turn around so the Strix shoots at my shield and not at me. That's bad, Nkai. We're gonna try to blow up on this Buck next and then the Anara and just try to ignore the Strix for now. Hopefully he's not able to do enough damage. Is he pushing up? He's right there. Oh, he was getting flanked on apparently. <laughs> that works. Okay, big picks, big picks. The uh, Io's going over to the right side. We try to. Oh my god, we couldn't dismount them. I hit shift to sprint. I sh poop you not, dude. Where's the. Okay, I think we can kill this Anara before anything happens. We've got too much damage for her. And that's a sniper. Watch the Atlas. She he can just one shot us. We will just kind of chill here for a second. And once someone jumps on, we can just kind of blow them up. But I don't think any of them are going to be able to jump on. No reason to push up right now. Coo, 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 coo. Okay. Oh, my lagoobers. He's going to try to wall behind. Oh! Never. Hello! Woo! Okay, come on, game. Thank you, thank you, game, for, like, just waiting after the leaf happened. I actually really appreciate that. Appreciate that. Uh, we will retreat. We're not going to pop our ult up again until we can get out. I think it's probably a safe bet. I don't think that Shaw's going to be able to get out, so we're going to have to wait all the way past that Shaw or that Shaw stagger. Uh, that extra damage, honestly, isn't that worth it. Honestly, right now, I mean, credits we have, we, we could use more, but whatever. Um, our ultimate's fully charged, and all that's, all that's really doing is giving the other team more stuff to heal, and that's not good. That's a bummer. Oh, I tried to help, buddy. Gotta run back. Got her shield up. Blow up my shield, please. Hey, come on. Look at that. Look at that mine doing absolute work, dude. No one's paying attention to it. Because unlike a presser mine from the Knessa, uh, it doesn't have a beam coming out of it, so that's nice. I, I honestly don't think I've really been able to take advantage of my... Oh, good old. I've been able to take advantage of my, of my talent at all, dude. I somewhat regret using this loadout because I'm forever going to just be used to this insta this insta aim down sight. It's actually pretty nuts. I'm becoming I'm becoming a fan. I see what you mean there, Jamesy. Can we just push through this? He asks us, he just does. I, in that moment, I feel like I should have just had opportunity in chaos. I just didn't let go of the left button. Da -da 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 We'll get inside the shield. T TK's Ragnarok. Oh, oh! I don't know if there's someone over here, but we're gonna keep retreating. And oh, wait, I jumped into it. I jumped into the Tootsie shot. Coming down to the last second, we have an overtime proc. I ended up going Haven three, by the way. In case you don't see that at the bottom. Our goal is to try to farm up our ult. That's all we really care about. It's good rewind. I got you, boo. Oh, I don't got you, boo. Oh, I do got you, boo. Never mind. I heard a, a plong noise, and I thought that was our teammate dying. It was not. Where are you going, buddy? Uh, do we go for this? I think we do, because we can try to play fast. Oh, we need to go over to the left side, but I can't do anything about this. So I'm going to go ahead and pop that in the back so we can reveal the Atlas. We have the shield up, so we're set. We're going to try to shoot at the... Oh, never mind. Da, 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 da. Reloading. Timeout. Oh, God. Buck's pissed. Oh, Nar almost down. Atlas, I don't think, has a rewind. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, wait, wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa there, buddy. Don't shoot. Thank you. No, we couldn't make it around fast enough. This sucks. This sucks. We don't want to die. No! So even though we said we wanted to save onto our all, we kind of made that last minute pull just to get that Strix. I felt like it was going to be really helpful. Uh, we need to drop down some Strix over there. So that kind of sucks. But we got morale boost. She's going to be forced up. Oh, all right. Got our got mind. Got to go. What? What wind up? Hey, I don't want to die. I'm too fast for you. <gasps> I.O.? Uh, Nara walled off the I.O., her teammate? Oh, that's Strix. Try to keep our uh, wits about us. Oh, made it across. Still got hit. Thank you, Damba. You're my hero. We're going to stay over on the right side underneath so we don't have to deal with the Strix. We have a good angle on this. If I can just get a few more hits on the Atlas, that means I can ult. Hello. Got our shield up. We're just going to have to burn through this, man. Don't stop believing. <laughs> hey, hey, not cool. 
Here, have this. Oh, that's a pass, my friend. That's a hard pass. Is that the first time Shaw's ulted? I swear I've never heard that Shaw ult. We're out sniping the Strix. Reloading. Give me a second here. Better get back into that. I will not leave this round. So overall, uh, I will say this. The first build was fun. It was something unique, but it still was Vivian stuff. You know what I mean? Vivian doing Vivian stuff. With the nerf to the talent that I've noticed in the second one, I don't think I'd ever run it. I, I felt like even though it was, I felt like sometimes it was getting destroyed, but it wasn't proccing. It has a nine second internal cooldown, but I don't know. Maybe when I rewatch this video, I'll uh, maybe notice it working, but it didn't seem like it was working that much. And they definitely fixed the, the bug where you could cancel it on your own to get half the cooldown. That was busted. So there's that. As for the second build with the reduced recoil down precision sites and the bringing up precision sites faster, I want to hate on it. I want to say it's not needed, but it felt so good. And when it comes down to me playing a certain champion, I think quality of life plays a much bigger role than a lot of people anticipate. Or maybe they don't realize how big of a quality of life things are over just the right thing to do. You know, get the life steal, get the, well, you gotta get the movement speed. That's a huge quality of life. And you could argue that life steal gives a good quality of life because you're living, but that being able to right click that quick is actually pretty nuts. It's 15% per, so I would maybe try messing around with this and dropping it down to a four and a three to see if it still comes up instantly. At the beginning, it felt like it was cheating how fast it was coming up. The movement speed, I definitely want in there. And eyes on the prize, I, I want to say that most of the time, depending on the map, you don't want to run this build because there might be very, very little times that you even want to bring up your precision. Like if you were playing on Bright Marsh or something, you just don't need it. You just left click. So you could swap these out for other things. And then you would just have like a basic Anara or Anara, a basic Vivian loadout. Sorry, I mix those up all the time. Same play style. <laughs> but if you're not aiming down in sight, you just want to change those out for something else like Lifesteal, Lifesteal for sensory drones or something along the lines of like generate an extra ammo or not use an ammo, a chance not to use ammo when you hit a shot or when you shoot, stuff like that. But overall, Vivian is a hold W, hold left click and run away when you need to. Not the most entertaining to me, but honestly, I had a lot of fun trying out new things and that's what's really gonna stick with me in the long run is you know, different play styles for Vivian, I dig it. I will say if she didn't have the movement speed card, which is by the way, staple on pretty much all Vivian loadouts, uh, she would feel pretty rough. But shout outs to Killua, I think it was Killua, right? Killua. Uh, James hates bread. But by the way, James hates bread? You hate bread? Bread is like my primary nutrition. Like that's that's my nutrients. I heard bread makes you fat, but I just don't care. And of course, Indulgence coming out with that fun little booby trap build. I enjoyed having the synergy of being able to hold out. It gave me a reason to aim down sight so I can get my, my drones up a little bit quicker. Maybe I, in the future, I could try like a full meme build going like Kronos and uh, what do you call it? Oh, a max out version of that, of that loadout. I think Kilua had one where it was mainly all about like extra duration and they, they called it like an infinite Cassie ult. That would be nice, right? Maybe we'll try that next. But for now, I'm going to head out of here. Let me know what you think about Vivian down in the comments. I hope you enjoyed it. That was backwards and whatever. Okay, bye. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm not going to be one of those people who asks you to like and subscribe, so I'm not going to ask.